Hello and welcome back. This is what I eat in a week of high protein vegan meals. So I started on Tuesday and for breakfast I made a smoothie. I used a banana, 250 milliliters of soy milk, 20 grams of protein, 20 grams of peanut butter powder, some blueberry maple syrup, and I blended that all up and this is a very delicious smoothie. I definitely recommend trying it. And I had an energy drink before my workout. And for lunch, I had three pieces of beans on toast with jalapenos and pico de gallo. For dinner, I had my lentil dal. I posted the recipe last week. And then I had some coconut water and a smoothie protein shake for my late night snack. And on Wednesday for breakfast, I made myself another smoothie. So this is just my apple pie smoothie. It's just some ice, a banana, and some muesli. You can use any kind of muesli. I've posted this recipe before in my What I Eat in a Day video. Uh, it's really simple. I make it a lot and it's very, very delicious. So just add some soy milk, some protein powder, and blend it all up nice and smooth. It's very, very good. I have it, I don't know, almost every single day. And for lunch at work, I had some rice cakes, a protein bar, and when I got home, I made myself a peaches and cream smoothie. And for dinner, I made this black pepper steak. It was a veganized version of this Chinese food dish I used to have a lot when I was younger. Um, comment if you want the recipe because it actually turned out really, really good and definitely meat eater approved. I love your food! <laughs> and I had an energy drink before my workout and some peanut butter toast after my workout. And for breakfast on Thursday, I had a yogurt and muesli bowl topped with some fruit and seeds. And then I wanted an iced coffee, so I just made myself an iced coffee protein shake, so just soy milk, um, protein powder, iced coffee flavor, and then I added some sugar-free chocolate syrup and sugar-free sugar and blended it all up nice and smooth. And honestly, it tasted pretty close to an ice cap from Tim Hortons in Canada, so highly recommend. And then for lunch, I wanted a burrito bowl, so I just made some Mexican TVP, so just TVP mixed with taco seasoning. And then I toasted up some corn with paprika, and then I warmed up the TVP. Once that was heated up, I just put some rice. I think I put like 150 grams of rice, and the corn, and the TVP. And I also made a little bit of pico de gallo with tomato, onion, and green onion. And then I topped it with some pickled jalapenos and a tablespoon of coconut yogurt. And then I added this jalapeno cilantro hot sauce on top and a little wedge of lime fresh from my garden. And that's the final result. And it was very, very delicious. I was clearly excited to eat it. And then for dinner, I just warmed up some leftover lentil dal with coconut yogurt in it. And then I had some brown rice crackers as a snack, and I've been recipe testing this protein fudge, so I had some of that. And for breakfast on Friday, I made myself some oats. So it's just 50 grams of oats, half of a banana sliced up, a sprinkle of cinnamon, 15 grams of protein peanut butter, 20 grams of peanut butter powder, and then I added some hot water and stirred it all up until it was combined. And then to that I added 20 grams of protein powder and stirred it all up until it was nice and smooth. I topped it with my favorite sugar-free blueberry maple syrup and a splash of soy milk and it was so good and then i had an energy drink and a coconut yogurt on the way to the beach and when i was there i had three pears after the beach we went to grilled and i had their beyond cheeseburger with fries and obviously it's vegan but it was amazing i loved it so much and then when i got home i had a double protein shake with some strawberries 
And for breakfast on Saturday, I had another smoothie. And then at work, I had some rice crackers and a protein bar. And when I got home, I made myself beans on toast with tofurkey deli slices. This was amazing. I highly recommend trying it out. And then I made this Thai yellow curry. I posted the recipe last week as well. So um, check it out. It was super, super good. High protein, low fat, and um, super delicious. Just topped it with some lime, cilantro, and chopped peanuts. And it was thoroughly enjoyed. And for breakfast on Sunday, I made a smoothie. It wasn't this one, but I forgot to record it. So here you go. And then uh, for lunch, I had leftover Thai curry. And then for dinner, I was too lazy to cook. So I had pizza and garlic bread from Domino's. And for breakfast on Monday, surprise, surprise, another smoothie. And then I had some peanut butter toast and an apple pie protein smoothie with that and a banana. And for dinner, I made this Indian curry with potatoes, peas, and TVP. Yeah, yeah, it's awesome. <laughs> And that's what I ate this week. Thanks for watching. Hope you got some ideas. Subscribe for more.